No way. I hate that you joined them, Sam. We used to be a team. Don't. Don't. That's not good. Walk like Peter Moylan day. Ariana Grande, is that? Yeah, Despicable Me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's some fuck. Guess who? Music edition. Hacks and Elrod. Jake Storielli. Wins. I'm gonna win. We have facts first round, then opinion. <laughs> Sky's fighting on Saturday. Woo! And MSG! She'll still kick everyone's ass here. <laughs> We've added a few more employees. Yeah. You guys came in April, right? Yeah. He's a friend of mine. He's awesome. Yeah. Kind of like, go to How are you? 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 Are you? are fighting this weekend? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Who's going down? You're an MSG veteran. I am. Second fight, MSG. That's why the US. Uh, last one you no, fought last in no, Australia, no, no. right? Pardon? You fought in last one in Australia? Yeah, in October. Yeah. We took a little bit of a break. Yeah. And an unwanted break. I want to keep fighting. She was ready to go in December, but Eddie just did the, the Warrington death part. It was, was jam-packed. Yeah. She was like on the standby. She was like pretty much on wait a week. Yeah. Didn't happen. Yeah. yeah. And we were meant to box like back to back for this. We were meant to box now and then box in, in March, but that's even looking like it's being pushed back as well. The guess who's content, get yeah. get silly with the guess who. Better than our interview, you know. Yeah, yeah. 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 So I'm actually like, and yesterday was like, oh, that was a long one. I was yeah. watching. That's like interrogation. I think Jake will win. Really? I think he's just got more. You mean you'll knock him out, or do you think you'll win? Like, you meant to stop him. Yeah. Okay. I just think Jake's got better training. He's got better. He's just like more dedicated. He has like yeah. more resources. Are yeah, you? and he actually like. I feel like Jake probably has like goals and ambitions to like go somewhere in boxing, whereas yeah. I think Tommy is just like more of a like vegetable boxing. Yeah, and this is like his chance to like make a make a bag. And, like, yeah, yeah. And go back to doing like he does like reality shows. Yeah, something like that. I don't know. I don't. I've never really followed any of it. Yeah. Do you like it, YouTuber boxing or not? I mean, I'm not for it or against it, but. As long as people know like the difference between like oh, real boxing and YouTube boxing. Yeah. I mean, uh, people are gonna tune in as like it's like almost like a car crash. Like you, you look at it, I mean, to I see would, what it's like. I mean, I would be in the tag team with just Alicia. Like, oh my god, yeah. We'd battle people. That'd be fun. You and Alicia versus uh, Katie and uh, Serrano. Yeah. <laughs> I would love that. Ready? <laughs> Three, two, okay. one, punch! Back. <laughs> okay, let me. Ah! 17. <laughs> 17. Oh, Yay! Oh, All right, Scott, here we go. Not a lot of pressure. You gotta beat 25. No pressure. Yeah. Ready? Ready? You got it. Three. Wait a second. Whoa. Whoa. Wait a second. Sorry, right, I got excited. <laughs> All right, you're on time. Three, two, one, go. Time. 27. Oh. The winner. winner. Box ball and challenge. Big. Scott Nicholson. Rigs. Rigs. <laughs> I lose again. I, I came in two. second. Yeah. Were you like getting proud for a second? That was gonna you win. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, you were actually in for a chance, there, especially when I. Train, did you ever use this in training? Yeah, but I use uh, a tennis ball, so it's like kind of a different. It's a little harder. Yeah. You came through. Thank you. But you do well under the bright lights. I do. I, you know. You might have yourself a career in New York sport. City. Yeah. All right, it's great diamonds. All right. Great. All right, we got uh, yeah. swag. Aw, oh, thank you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, sure. yeah, yeah, Oversized and a nice jam shirt. Oh, so Good luck on Saturday. Take it home. Yeah, I'm gonna come Thursday. Oh, cool. All right, cool. All right, guys. Thank you. Take care. Three belts, huh? Three. Four. And you're wearing one. Four belts. 
Abs true to form. Nike's on. Gloves look like This is off. so sweet. Pretty sick, right? I like how the media is just five dots of white. Da, 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 da. Yeah, I think he <laughs> gave up there. That'd be good with the little worm leaking out. Shows that I'm not actually a scientist. I don't want people thinking that. Okay. Mike. Great. Mike and Ike. Got video and audio. What's your favorite candy, Mike? Uh, I like Reese's Pieces a lot. Yeah. Those are very good. I'd be cut off from those as a kid. Yeah. I used to get too hyper on them. You can just keep going. Really <laughs> yeah. <easy. laughs> yeah. Good. Kind of fucked up on Reese's Pieces. Fuck <laughs> out. <laughs> I mean, maybe we use the song in intro. I don't know. Why not? It's electric. Someone Talking clipped that. Jake here, and we are oh ranking. Oh my god! Annoying voice. At number four, Trey Turner. He's really good. Look at the numbers. Trey Turner's really good. At number seven, it's Tim <laughs> Anderson. T A seven, Mr. Batflip batting title. Yup. At number one, it's Fernando Tatis Jr. Hot. Sexy, really good at baseball. He can Too run, soon. he can pass at three. I have Trevor's story. I like him a lot. I just think he needs to get out of Colorado, man. That place is kind of a he bummer. Did. Ha 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 ha, welcome to your nightmare. You guys ever watch Modern Family? All right, second audio sync. It's because we delayed it 15 minutes. <laughs> Dope claps by me, to be honest. What is going on, everybody? It is your baseball professor talking, Jake, and we are here doing top 10 and the worst catchers. One of the best two-way catchers in baseball. He's now in Atlanta, and I think he's going to shine bright like a diamond, bad girl, Riri. I'm a plug. Hey, everyone. 42% of you guys out there are going to experience moderate to extensive hair loss. And everybody likes having hair because you get to run your fingers through it and, and do other stuff. You dye it if it's going gray. Like me, if I was bald, I'd never be able to dye my hair. And that's like a fun thing. I did it this morning. So research shows that 80% of men who use prescription hair loss treatment had no further hair loss after two years because Roman is helping them out. Getting started is simple, complete, a free online visit that a US licensed healthcare professional will come over your house with a comb, check if you have lice. Never mind, they'll just work with you to find the best treatment plan. Roman then ships it directly to you in a discreet packaging with free two day shipping. The whole proce process is straightforward and discreet. Right now, Roman has a special offer for our listeners. Use this link to get 20% off your first order. Just go to row.co slash John Boy today for 20% off. Jake actually used this on his nether regions. He was, um, his pubes just started falling out and he needed to get them back in. So it works everywhere, I guess. Asterix, maybe. I like the top row there. Cause the warehouse is like kind of, mm -hmm. has that gritty, like black and gray. Yeah. So I like playing off that. So they seem like the same. He sent these, these are pretty, but I like the shape and the theme of it, because this can be a patch, it can be on a hat, it can be... I would like to see it with Roman numerals. Okay. But... And we'll stick to the top three for now. I mean, we got to narrow it down, so... Yeah. Joes, whenever you're ready, make sure you address the camera. You can actually interact with the judges this mm -hmm. time, because they are, they have a mic. Oh, so they're giving me advice? No, no, we'll be judging. <laughs> they're judging. Uh, my name is Joes. And I will be building a volcano today. All right, um, we gotta build this volcano. Where's this from? <laughs> this. <laughs> Actually, this looks, there's a lot going on. Um, okay, all right. Um, I feel like I got too many tools because now it's like, I wanna use everything. Kinda was a little bit a little bit of a junior scientist, whatever that means. I was just in like different kind of science clubs, straight nerd. We are coming up against like deadlines, kind of. I know that next week Jake's gone, I'm gone as well. And I feel like, or at least anticipating that for, for some stuff, 
that week, like the 20th or whatever of February, is going to start feeling like crunch time. I can start because I check something off my list that I'm excited about. We have the pre and post plans for the pre-game show and post-game show. The logistics are mapped out for the night before day one when everyone flies in and is at the hotel. Get a banquet hall at a hotel or get a space with a projector and do like a full-blown orientation the night before. Hand out all the jerseys, hand out all the crew shirts and the warm-ups and the pamphlets and go over the basic rules. How do you feel about a division that holds the Yankees, Mets, Red Sox, and Phillies? I think we like it till we didn't like it. I think that's every. I don't need these Mets. I'd like one other team out. What do you mean? Like, can we swap the Phillies with like the Orioles? No, they're close. Phillies go to the North. It's about the Phillies play the Blue Jays. They're in the Blue Jays division. Why would we put the Phillies who are in the tri-state area out? Isn't it? You love Philly. No, the point Philly is. Philly Joe's is here. Wow. The point Philly is. Philly Joe's. The point is to have these teams closer to each other. Okay, Pop. Well, those teams have gone further than your Yankees, so your Yankees are out of the playoffs. Congrats. You played yourself. I'm a Yankee fan. How do I know you're a Yankee fan? The Red Sox are not. Have not gone. Have not, not going further than the Yankees. What are you talking about? They went to the World Series. Yeah, not last year. They went to the ALCS in 21. It's in the past. The team's not even there anymore. What? Whose team? Their real team. That team that went to the whatever. It's not even there anymore. Fake. The Red Sox are fake? Vlog title? Like, yeah. all those teams have it's big budgets. It's called the Big Spenders Division. Right. Would you like that? Now I'm kind of into it. <laughs> yeah. I you get know. it now. That's the big Spanish yeah. division. Let's Hell go. Yeah. Right. Let's compete. Hell yeah. Yankees, 75 and 84. Why would they do that? Even Tampa with that budget. They you want to be with the big ballers. I want to be with the big ballers. You might get big balls on your face. No. No. Can't have big balls on your face if you got big balls. That's a good saying. <laughs> it's not a good saying. It is. You can't just say it's a good saying that makes it true. That's a good saying. <laughs> Did you subscribe to that? <laughs> I didn't subscribe Are you subscribed to the coffee and they gave you that? I, I think they hate me. They won't learn my name and they serve me the wrong coffee. You said last week you're never going back. I know, this is my first time back because I was what like, is, I kind of look this, fucking good today. Where is this place? Yeah, and look like they just look like spit like on me. They basically yeah. just spit on me. I want that sweater. How much? Let me how much. <laughs> <laughs> Watching LeBron yesterday. Do you see what happened? Yeah, he kind of got the record. Yeah. Most shot attempts, LeBron James. He's the man. Best player I ever seen. Jim, how do you feel about realignment? For teeth or your spine or what? No. Sorry, you need. Don't. Uh, la you need you need teams with lesser fan bases in divisions. If you take the Rays and you put them in the NL Central, they folded. Ten years ago, they folded. They relocated and they're out. Good. Survival of the fittest. Who's the most underrated player you know? We were gonna record. <laughs> <laughs> what are you recording? We're doing. Are we out talking baseball? At ten. Oh. oh shit. <laughs> Up. I was setting up. There's a lot of prep for this episode. You came with two coffees? Not yesterday. It's just hanging out. Should I put you on the side? Yeah. 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 What the fuck are these skates? What are we doing? <laughs>